What's up guys, this is Osas from Samsung Galaxy S3 Soft Modder and today I'm going to be showing you the latest and greatest um, application switcher. It's called Switcher Beta. It's right here. It's without the E. Um, and this is a private beta so in order to actually download it you're going to have to follow the directions that I've laid out in the um, full tutorial on Samsung Galaxy S3 Soft Modder. But basically you go to the link that's provided in the full tutorial you join the community, um, you, you request to be a, a tester, and then um, you'll get the link to the Google Play Store, and then you'll from there you just install it. And once you install that, um, they'll show you a little tutorial, which I've obviously done already, and I'll show you how to use the application. And then you'll jump here into the settings by clicking on the icon at any time. And so here you have general, then you're going to have um, switcher, which is just app specific support and then feedback. Um, but we're going to stay focused on switcher. And so the first thing you want to do is you want to select your style. And you can select either flow or slide. So I'll just show you both. Um, you'll get this little thing right here. And then you'll see this little flashing area. And that's where you're going to actually want to do it. And here, you see it's all one finger, which is really cool. So it's one finger you'll be able to switch back and forth between different applications. So if I do that, it will take me to settings. And I can just go back and then go right back into switcher. Um, and then using the other mode, which I'll show you, um, which is slide. This is just, as you can see here, you have to go like twice if you're going to switch through applications. So I'll just show you that. So it'll be right here, and then you can go back, back, and you see how the apps switch. And then if you want to kill an app, you drag it all the way there, like so. Um, so those are the pretty much the two main things you want to do. I personally, I personally like um, the flow style more, so that's what I use. In general, here you can change the position. So left edge, right edge. You can see it's flashing right there. I prefer left edge, as I think most people would, that are right-handed. Uh, the sensitivity, you can adjust it there. Vibrate on trigger. Here's a blacklist and a whitelist that you can create for apps that you want or don't want to appear. Start on boot, you obviously want that checked. And then you can go back to switcher, show app name, cover flow effects. So you can change the fade, the zoom, stuff like that if you, if you really want. Hit back. And there's just a whole bunch of different options and then another cool thing is if you are having problems like swipe isn't working or the screen's not responsive enough you can actually go to the support panel click on this and then actually click fix it and it'll actually try to fix it for you same with um, screen responsiveness it'll attempt to fix it for you and then there's also more stuff and then obviously as you're a beta user you will have access to the developer so that's him right there Mohammed and you can also just leave feedback in this next um, section. So that's really the app itself. It's actually probably one of the sleekest and smoothest ones that I've used and that I've covered. Um, it looks great and as you can see it works just as advertised. And there are no ads, thank goodness, but again it'll be available on October 20th in the Play Store. There is no price listed but I would assume it's not going to be for free, but maybe it is. So you can also make sure to check that out in the Play Store. So that's October 20th. Um, the app is called Switcher. It's available through the beta at the link provided in the full tutorial. So make sure to check out the full tutorial for more information and all the links that you need. And uh, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks, guys.